blessing upon these rings. Oh Lord, we pray that you would bless these rings to be a sign and reminder of the vows by which this man and this woman have bound themselves to each other through Jesus Christ our Lord. These rings, although they are small in size, they are very large in their meaning. They are made of precious metal. May they remind us that love is not cheap and it is not common. They are made in a circle. Their design tells us that love must never come to an end. You must keep it continuous. As you wear these rings, whether together or apart for a moment, may they be constant reminders of the promises that you are making here this day. Tony, will you take the ring that you are giving to Alicia? And while you are placing it on her finger, repeat this promise after me. I give you this ring, give you this ring. as a sign of my love, sign of my love. And, my faithfulness. and my faithfulness with all that I have, with all that I have. and all that I am. I honor and cherish you. I honor and cherish you. Alicia, will you now take the ring that you are giving to Tony and while placing it on his finger, repeat this promise after me. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of my love. As a sign of my love. And my faithfulness. And my faithfulness. With all that I have. With all that I have. And all that I am. I honor and cherish you. Tony and Alicia have wanted to do something which would be symbolic of the blending of their families together. Each person will have their own portion of sand which they will pour into the jar which represents their individual lives. And in the end, after each person has poured their sand into the jar, it will represent the blending of two families into one loving family unit which is formed through this marriage that we are witnessing here today. This jar, which has now been displayed with the different 
Colors of sand representing all the individuals will now represent the blending of one loving family unit forevermore. God's blessings be upon it and a reminder of the family that you have created this day. Let us once again be in the spirit of prayer together. Our Heavenly Father, we come today asking your blessing upon Tony and Alicia and their new family together being established. You have made us so that we are incomplete without the other, so that we yearn for someone we can love and whose love we can receive. We are thankful for the love that we see here, but even more so for the love that we feel from you. May we never take your love for granted. We pray, dear Lord, that your love will be the shield and stay for Tony and Alicia. When joy comes, may they share it together. When sorrow threatens, may they bear it together. In gladness or in tears, in sunshine or shadow, may they ever be closer to each other and nearer to you. Lord, we pray that you would grant them patience gentleness and understanding. O oh, Father, we beseech you to protect them from those forces that would break them apart. We ask for health, long life, fulfillment of every dream they have. May their love continue through this life and blend into life eternal. Through Christ our Lord we pray. <clears throat> Amen. Now go into the world and fulfill your dreams. Give to one another new experiences of joy. <coughs> Challenge one another that you may grow. And never take the love that you share for granted. Let it be your guide, your shelter, and your comfort. Let this love, which is now sealed in marriage, continue to mature. That your life together may be a source of strength and inspiration and happiness for all the days to come. Now that Tony and Alicia have given themselves to each other by solemn vows before us and before Almighty God as witnesses and have shown their affection and trust by the giving and receiving of rings, by the joining of their hands, by the power vested in me by God, the Christian Church, and the State of Maine, I now pronounce that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Therefore, what God has joined together, let man not separate. Amen. You may now seal your vows of marriage with your first kiss as husband and wife. Please turn and face your guest. It is with great pleasure, pleasure and great honor to present to you for the very first time as husband and wife, Tony and Alicia Jeffords. Yeah. Folks, if you don't mind, you take your own chairs down to the table. That way you'd have a place to sit. Yep, awesome. <laughs> Everyone has to take the table. Take it. I need all the family to stay. <laughs> <laughs> 